Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Gulf Coast Wrestling Best of the Indies Tournament, episode number three. And here we have the WWE portion of the tournament. Leo Rush from NXT, ladies and gentlemen, will be taking on Enzo Amore. This man right here, I know nothing about. He is from NXT. And that is about all I know. A lot of people seem he's got th seem to think he's got a lot of potential, and well, I guess we must think he's got a lot of potential if they gave him, if they gave him us, you know, if they gave him to us for our little best of the Indies tournament. So let's see how this toins out. Leo Rush, Leo, Leo, L I O R U S H. Let's go. Renzo and Morde now. And here it is that classic whatever noise he makes. Enzo Amore. Enzo Amore Sporting NWO attire. Well this is different. What could Enzo Amore be doing with NWO attire? His name is Enzo Amore. A certified G and a bona fide stuff. And you can't teach that. Why is Enzo Amore sporting NWO attire to the ring? Now this is different for many reasons. I I don't remember Kevin Nash and Scott Hall signing into Amore. I think Enzo Amore was born during that time frame. He was he was like three. All right, let's go. Let's get this underway, shall we? Enzo Amore missing with a grapple. Oh. All right, thank, thank you for that. Into the corner now. Ref, trying to gotta get in here and break it up here. Oh, Enzo Amore with a slap. Drop kick by Enzo Amore. Enzo Amore gets him up, gets the kid up. Irish whip by Leo. Or Leo, Leo. I don't know. It's L I O. Call him Rush. I don't know. And some more sliding out of the ring with that snow white hair. About matches his Leo's tights. Leo's tights. Swear. Oh, and a big punch right to the face. And some more giving no respect to Rush. But Rush with a suplex, sidewinder suplex, and Enzo Amore climbing to the side of the ring, trying to regain composure. Oh, and gets punched off for his troubles. I thought he was about to jump on him like that. It's like, but crushes everything. Enzo Mori gets out of it. And, uh, and slams him down on that very, really unprotected mat on the outside. Slams him into the barricade, that metal barricade. Oh, and now into the stairs. Enzo Mori will gladly take a count out yelling at the mat like a crazy man now oh, they're doing a little dancing now I'm trying to finish his dance from earlier I want to get a drop kick catch a rush off guard elbow to the face and I get an elbow to the face oh and Enzo on the outside now oh and again punches out to the outside Rush not having any of Enzo's shenanigans. Punch to the back. And again. And again a drop kick. That seems to be Enzo's favorite move here. That surprise drop kick to keep him off. And again against the barricade. Oh, and a, and a stunner to, the, to Leo. 
Lyo, rush. What's his face? Again, Enzo going to do his little dance over in the corner. Still not sure. Actually, really has most of the crowd puzzled of why he's wearing NWO attire. But this could, I assume, it could only mean one thing: that Enzo is NWO. Oh, and a stunner of his own. Oh, standing star press. I assume uh, I'm gonna go more of a song ish. Chili. Calling Enzo to get back to his feet. And uh, kind of misses. I don't know why there's a dirty pin there. If I would have clicked that one, what would happen? And a kick out by Enzo Amore. That was a two count. Rush. Got him. Gets Enzo's head in between his legs. Now, Enzo gets out of it. And a one for the drop kick again. Leo learned. Oh, and a big punch to the face this time. He's got him. Goes for the suplex on Rush. Enzo, putting on, trying to put on a clinic here. Oh, and a big crossbody. And Enzo, where the finishing move? I forgot what it's called. It's got such a weird name. It's really easy to forget. Enzo hits his finishing move. Goes for the pin in the middle of the ring. One, two. Oh, and a kick out by Rush. Enzo thought that was it. Not having, not getting Rush any time to recuperate. Going right back on the attack of Rush. Which is, I have to say, smart by Enzo Martin, no matter how much you don't like him. It's just smart tactic, but Rush with a big uppercut. Oh, and a big punch. Goes for the sidebar suplex, and again gets it. Rush. He's trying to get the crowd on the side. Oh, Enzo Martin reverses. Oh, shoot! And again, Enzo Amari reverses. Now that I've hit that comeback move. Oh, shoot! Darn it, nab. Enzo Amari, walking. Enzo Amari, I guess, doesn't care about the best of the Indies championship. Because Enzo Amari's just gonna leave. Dancing on the ramp. I don't think that's a smart idea when Rush is right behind you. I don't think you noticed. Oh, and Enzo. Went for a drop kick and made it as a st one stupid kid. Rush picks up Enzo and throwing him back toward the ring. Rush leaving now. Bye, Rush. Uh. Uh. I'm not. I'm not sure why he did that. I don't know what the count's at. Hold on. Can I go to options real quick? Um. Gameplay settings. Gameplay manual. Okay. Thank you for that. Options. Uh, ringside camera cut. Sure. Uh, yeah, please have that on. Because I don't know what the count is. On six. That is enough to get back in the ring. Oh, right. Thank you for that. Kick to the head. Brilliant. Gets the reversal. Oh, and he reverses. My bloody finishing move. But I know. <laughs> Now with a suplex, Rush, how to stand him up. Rush taunting to the crowd. Enzo is a very dangerous competitor when he needs to be, and so I would taunt too much and a drop kick. Enzo back on Rush. Irish whip. I want a clothesline to Rush. Trying to pull the poor kid's head off. Big punch reverses. I have no reversals. Enzo Moore slides out of the ring. Rush follows. Hot pursuit. Oh, and throws him back in the ring. Enzo. Trying to get some time to just recuperate and reprieve. Ref keeping him from going outside the ring. Enzo. On the apron. Oh, went for the punch and got reversed. Landed around like the kidney area. Rush being very confident here in this match. And I understand why he is. He's got Enzo Amore on the floor on the outside. Pulls him. Oh, neck breaker on the ropes. Uh, that was real. What? 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 No. Enzo Amore being 
being told about our truth. Leo! Leo Rush! With a backbreaker! And now Triple H from the 90s has come out to interrupt Leo! For God knows why! I can't see what's. Roll up! Roll up in the ring! One! Two! And a kick up on Leo! This has gone to utter chaos! I don't know what's going on! Triple H is out here! I don't. We just had an interruption from our truth! I'm getting lightheaded! I don't bloody know what's going on! I hope Triple H can stop this pin! Nope, Enzo does it for himself! And Enzo! Lost it! Your Jun's! Your Junzo! The Jurdanzo. I just now remember the name. Enzo, Enzo's got his feet on the rope though. Enzo's got his feet on the rope. One, not like this. Not like this. No, oh my God, not like this. Enzo Amore has just beaten Leo Rush with the help of Triple H. And kind of our truth. I'm not sure. The end of that match got really screwy, and I'm not sure how that happened. It's never happened before. Triple H and Enzo Amore. Triple freaking H and Enzo Amore. Good God of mine. Enzo Amore is a part of the NWO. Triple H has just helped Enzo Amore. God knows why. Well, alright then. Thank you guys for watching Global F Gulf Coast Championship Wrestling. Gulf Coast Wrestling. Episode 3, Best of the Indies. We will see you guys in Episode 4.